good morning. I don't know if you guys feel the same, but I have little to no motivation during the winter time, especially on gloomy and cold days like this. But I've made it a goal this year to enjoy even the gloomiest days, whether that's waking up early just to make a cup of coffee to stay in and watch my favorite shows on a rainy day, or go out of the comfort of my home just to complete even the simplest task like editing at a coffee shop. I'm getting ready to go to a coffee shop right now. I'm putting these cute little bows in my hair. I'm literally just gonna edit on my computer. I feel like I haven't been getting ready lately and I always feel like whenever I look my best or whenever I feel like I look my best, I'm like the most productive and I'm always doing something. I'm just wearing this white long sleeve. And then my Levi's. I just got this perfume. It smells so freaking good, oh my God. Got my jacket on. It's a little small cafe, so I hope it's not too packed in there. are both about to knock out look at her frida paws all out it's so early but i'm already so sleepy because i mean i mean i did wake up early this morning so i'll see you guys in the morning good morning I have just been sitting here eating my chocolate croissant that I got at the farmer's market yesterday and I have been reading A Court of Thorns and Roses. I started reading this book a long time ago but I kind of stopped in the middle of it because I started watching Game of Thrones. I can't like watch an interesting show and read an interesting book at the same time because then I feel like I'll get confused. I don't know. I just don't trust myself. I read like halfway through it and then, then I picked it up this morning because I wanted to continue reading it, but I decided to just go all the way back to the beginning. Mmm, so good. This whole morning, it was like super foggy. So I figured today was the perfect time to finally sit down and read the book. I want to try to get halfways today. I know that I probably won't. I want to at least try to get to chapter 19. up with a little more coffee before I left. I just spilled that all over my face. Okay, I'm getting ready to go to Barnes & Noble. I'm gonna buy the second book to this because I already know once I finish this, I'm gonna wanna start the second book like right away. Also, um, I got tickets to go see the Nutcracker. But let's head out to go get book number two really quickly and then we'll come back and get ready. I already have Ooh. the whole, that whole, the off-campus series. I'm looking for... Um, her. Oh my god. Look what we have here. 
I don't even know. What are these? I don't know. <laughs> They're cute. I just, made, right? I just made that one. It's sweet. You know how we want donuts? Yeah. Well, guess what? That's what I'm So I need you to oh. taste them to see if they taste good. These look so good! Okay. Look at how yummy these look! Mmm, mmm, mmm. They're so easy to make. So easy. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Running late, of course, as always. The fit with the boots, but I'm not gonna put them on right now. Okay, let's go to the ballet! Okay, I've been slowly getting back into journaling. Right now, this is kind of like a junk journal. I feel like I always say I'm getting back into journaling and then it only lasts for like a week. I think now I finally figured out my way of journaling. Lately, I've just been writing down my goals and what has happened in my life. Like I wrote a whole page about my jewelry collection dropping and the whole experience about that. I'm gonna try to make it into like a scrapbook too. With each experience that I write down, I'll put like pictures. It's like kind of a journal slash scrapbook. Yeah. <laughs> 